Hi, my little bunnies. Oh my God, Merry Christmas. Happy New Year's to you guys, even though New Year's didn't come yet. It's coming, it's coming, it's coming. This is actually the night of Christmas. I had my fun with my family all day today and now it's late. I decided to go ahead and film before I have to get all this stuff put away. So I'm so excited to be here with you guys. I miss you guys so much. I've had so many of you guys reach out to me and be like, girl, where are you? I've had you DM me. I've had people text me and call me because some of you guys, I do have a relationship off of YouTube with now. And some of you guys have wrote me on YouTube, on Facebook, on Instagram. Like, where are you? Come back. <laughs> and I said I was going to be back in a few days and things just got in the way. But life has treated me good and bad. And I'm actually working on creating another channel for you guys, which I'm still keeping this platform and I'm actually back to stay. So you guys will not be seeing me gone for months and months again. Um, I am here to stay and I am going to be creating another channel for you guys to check out and see what I've been up to in my life and what's been going on. So I'm not going to get into that detail because then that's just going to ruin it. And then not only that, I look a little oily. Oof. Anyway, yeah, this is all day makeup. So <laughs> I look a little oil, but um, I'm not going to get elaborate too much on that because then it's going to spoil the new channel. But I am here to stay, you guys, and I miss you guys. I'm going to jump straight into this video. So this video is actually what I got for Christmas. I figure why not just come out that way? Um, I have the time and I'm ready and I'm ready to start off the new year coming just like girl get these videos out so I missed you guys so much so thank you guys for all the writing and the get back here girl because it just makes me appreciate a lot of you guys have held on to me and waited for me and I appreciate that so much I love you guys um so this is a what I got for a uh, Christmas video I do want to say as a disclaimer, this in no way is for me bragging or boasting or doing anything of that sort. It is just me sharing my excitement with you guys and sharing what I got for Christmas. And those of you guys who may have not have got anything physical for Christmas, um, don't feel bad at all because this is no way for me to make you feel bad. But do not feel bad because if you were with your friends, your family, even if you couldn't be with them and you talk to them, that is bigger than any physical gift that you can receive. So just always remember that we can't take any of this stuff with us when we go. So your loved ones, your friends, whoever, I don't care if it was a stranger, you spending time talking to or anything is way more bigger than any gift that you can receive. So just know that. So as I said, this is no way of me bragging or boasting. It's just simply me sharing my happiness with you guys and sharing what I received from my family. So most of what I got was from my husband. I did receive some gifts that I'm not able to bring to the table. I'll show you guys later on in another video because they're a little heavy and a little bit stored away um, from family members. But let's just jump straight into this because it's going to be a long video. There's actually going to be a part two to this video. So make sure after you watch this one, you watch part two. I will make sure I put part one and part two so you know that that is the second video because I got a lot of stuff this year and it's going to be a long video. So Let's just jump straight into it. How about that? Okay. So, excuse me. First and foremost, I am so excited because I had this purse a while ago. I think Hubby bought it for me way back when and it got damaged. And I was so sad because I loved this purse so much and my husband finally found me another one. I was so excited. He, I, I talked about it for a while and then I just stopped talking about it and he decided to look for it and he found me another one and you guys the crazy thing is I don't know if you guys remember when I did an Ashley Stewart video way back when and I found these perfect boots to go with that purse and it got damaged so now I'm so excited that they he found it he found it and this goes with them boots perfectly pattern color everything so I'm excited about that and then he also bought me these wallflowers for my duty room because I'm changing up my duty room right now. Um, these do fold out. It's not going to stay folded like that just so you guys know. Um, it does fold out. But um, I'm changing up my duty room right now. I'm actually changing it in a whole different location in my house also. So um, uh, basically the color theme, he decided to get me these wallflowers. So that's that. <laughs> that's that no no point in keeping uh, elaborating on that same thing but anyway 
Um, he also got me this handbag, which is Chanel inspired. It is not Chanel, but it's Chanel inspired. It is so beautiful. I love it, you guys. It is gold. I actually wore this with a gold button-up shirt today for Christmas. I actually changed that because I was sweaty and hot and felt disgusting. So I actually changed that. But I wore it with a gold um, button-up shirt today. So, yeah, it was very beautiful, very nice purse. Love it, love it, love it. Also, he got me this so cute. It's called Let It Snow Girl Limited Edition Makeup Collection. And this is by Too Faced. And it comes with a mascara. Um, I believe it's a highlight palette, eyeshadow palette, and a blush palette. And it is so adorable, you guys. I absolutely love this. I don't even want to take it out of the package. You know how sometimes you see them girly things that are so pretty and you just don't even want to remove them or use them? This is one of them things. She is a little snow girl. So pretty. So I love that. And then, you guys, I am super addicted, which was in the one of them was in the other bag. I am super addicted to when I gift people things. Like, even when I just go to somebody's house, I love to gift them, like, wine or if they drink a certain kind of liquor or something like that. I gift them that when I come to their house, especially for the first time. But anytime you go visit somebody, you want to kind of bring them something like a wine bottle or something. They're inexpensive. You don't have to go out and buy some, like, $100 bottle of champagne. But just, like, a cheaper, nice, nice flavored bottle. So, anyway, um, he bought me some of these um, bags because he knows how much I do that. And, um... Normally, I buy the ones from the Dollar Tree and they're just paper, but these are keepsake ones. I thought they were really pretty. There's another one. But as you see, this was my theme this year. This stuff is coming all down at the first of the year, okay? Well, probably the second because I'm not going to take it down New Year's Day. Obviously, I'll be busy. But anyway, um, so he bought me a couple of the bags and they are keepsake bags and you can put wine, um, liquor, whatever in here. And he did that because he knows how much I do that. I do it a lot. Um, also, he got me this blanket to throw on my um, leather sofa that I keep in my beauty room. Um, it is golden white and the gold is like a very metallic-y gold. It's so beautiful. I absolutely love it. It's a huge throw blanket. I can either throw it over the couch or I can just lay it across the couch. So if somebody comes and cozies up in my makeup room, they can, um, or should I say diva room, they can just cuddle up with the blanket if they choose to, if they're cold. And then also, um, you guys, I was so thrilled. Um, I actually seen this at this dollar store that I went to. And I was like, hmm, I kept going back and forth. Like, hmm, what can I use that for? What can I use that for? Well, hubby ended up going back and getting it because he thought of it. And he said he thought of uh, thought of it at the time that I was in the store when I wasn't even thinking of it, of what I can do with this. I'm taking it out the box. And he went back and got it. And as you see, they have like these rhinestones down here, rhinestones all around here. I don't know if you guys can even see the rhinestones. But anyway, he was like, and it has a handle. This is actually for utensils. And he, he was like, she can use that for her makeup brushes on her vanity. So he went back and actually bought it. And it is for utensils, like forks and spoons and knives or whatever. But when I was like, what can I use that for? I love it. It's so pretty. He was thinking and I wasn't. So he went back and got it and didn't say nothing to me at the time because he figured he was going to go get it. So sneaky, sneaky husband. Um, I also got this set and I took it out today because I was so curious because it was so heavy. Um, was this brush set. Oops. And it looks like this. And I took it out of the box because I was so curious. I'm like, what is does this thing do? And it has this felt on the bottom so it doesn't slide. And it's like this little bar and it comes with these brushes and this is magnetic I mean it's so cool so and I know for sure he got this from Sam's Club because I did see it there but anyway so look look at that y'all and then you can also put it on top you could put it on the bottom this way the only thing you can't do is this because they're too heavy maybe the smaller ones let me even try I never even tried that maybe the smaller ones can stick straight out I don't want to spend too much time on this because I have so much stuff. Let me see. They're still a little too heavy for that. But, um, yeah, so that's so awesome. And you just put your brushes there and they just stand up because it's magnetic. And there's magnets at the bottom of this. So I was very grateful for that. It's a cute little brush set. And that is that. 
I know. I'm, I, I'm, I always get so much makeup. And I already buy makeup a lot through the year. And then hubby buys me makeup for occasions. And it's just like, oh, oh, makeup. But I can't stop. I'm just addicted. Um, also, he got me this palette, which I opened up today and messed with it. I had to do my little finger fit test and all that this morning when I opened them up. This is the... Th um, uh, 3503 Fierce by Nature palette and it is the Morphe palette and let me tell you guys I promise you if you buy this palette it is so worth it. Morphe is inexpensive anyway but this palette is amazing. I really didn't even want to open it up and swatch it but I have to swatch at least one of them. I think I got some makeup wipes somewhere too. This one does not come with a mirror but it does come with all the names of the colors but I'm just going to swatch just to show you guys how gorgeous this is. Okay, let's just do this. You barely even have to touch that. And that's glitter. And their glitter is so fine. It's not even chunky or whatever. And then I'm going to do, just say this color. And I'm barely touching, you guys. And when I tell you this palette is gorgeous and I don't work for Morphe. I don't do no, this was paid for by hubby. I don't do no um any of that. Even if I did get paid by Morphe or got some things from them, I still would tell you the truth. I wouldn't care. I, if they said, you know what, if you lie, don't lie, I'm cutting you off, I would never sell you guys on something to um, use your hard work and money to buy something just so I can receive free items. I, like, even if I couldn't afford to buy it myself, I wouldn't do that. I think that is so wrong. I, I just wouldn't do it. Just hold on, let me get out. Next things that he got me... Um, well, this came actually with some of the things that he ordered online because he did order some stuff from Ulta. So it came with a lot of samples. And I'm not going to show you all of the samples because it's just too much to go through. But they sent some really cool name brand stuff like Buxom. And they sent um, even like a little NARS. And like, how does that happen in a, in, in a pot like that? And they sent me the... Um, uh, you Saint Laurent, uh, Laurent, sorry, uh, perfume sample. I mean, just so much name brand and good stuff in this sample bag. I was like, hey, and then just the bag alone is gorgeous. So anyway, he got me, well, he didn't get me that. That came with what he got me. Then he also got me this set here, and this is actually by Target. Um, it is $8. It is actually a blush, bronzers, and eyeshadows, or I think it's just eyeshadows and bronzers yeah you probably can use this one as a blush if you're fair skin but yeah very cute set i love it i love it i love it and then you guys i could not wait to show you guys this because i was blown away when i um tested this today rev um everybody knows revolution and revolution has stepped up their game dramatically. I always liked Revolution, but I was not a huge fan of Revolution. Let me tell you, Revolution has stepped up their game so much that a lot of big brands and expensive brand palettes can't touch them. And I'm I honest to God, I'm telling you the truth. This palette here he got me, and I actually was in Ulta and tested some of these out. I tested this one and the silver one, and I was like, hmm, because I was gonna get it and I didn't, but hubby ended up getting it for me. And it there's a big mirror here, and it comes with these colors. As you see, I was swatching the heck out of these this morning because I had to reassure myself that when I swatched them in Ulta, that it was not some like magical palette that Ulta just had sitting out there that was a better formula than I was gonna buy. I don't know, but I just had to because I was so blown away at how great it was. I'm gonna swatch a couple of these, and it's so buttery. Like I mean, so I I barely have to touch it. It's so buttery. So I'm just going to swatch a couple colors real quick. I'm not even going to show you the colors that I'm swatching because I need to get through this. And it's like am <laughs> amazing. Like I want to cry. It's it, it, I'm not even joking. Look at you guys. Look at you guys. And it is so, so, it almost feels like a cream because it's so buttery. And the metallic colors are so metallic-y. They almost look like glitter, but it's not chunky. It's not, oh, you guys. Oh my God. If you guys see this palette in Ulta and it's not expensive, I can't even remember how much it was when I seen it at the store. 
Um, I should, maybe I'll ask Hubby how much he paid. He probably won't even remember anyway. Because I'm sure they got him and made him throw a bunch of stuff in the, he always goes there like, what's going, what's good going on with women like today? And they just toss shit and, and they just toss stuff. Okay, also he got me, um, this Rihanna, um, perfume. And I was blown away when I seen this. This is a 4.2 ounce. Normally I think they're like five, I mean 3.2 two or 3.5 this is a 4.2 a huge bottle of Rihanna it is so beautiful it smells amazing I smelt this this morning I actually wore this today I actually wore this one today because I just had to <laughs> it's a different scent than I have and you know how a lot of times when you buy perfumes and stuff they kind of sell, smell similar so um, I was like okay let me just put this bag up here and I'm just gonna tip it over and then he got me a ton of these. He bought me like um, five of these. This is the Acne Free Dermatology Inspired Care Witch Hazel Mattifying Toner Shine Control. Now I do not use toner every day and I wanna tell you toner is okay to use but do not use it every day because it will strip you of your natural oils and when it does that if you have oily skin your skin will start saying oh my god the oils the natural oils are gone it will start per like just protruding way more oil than it needs to to try to make up for the natural oils that you took away so don't tone every day i don't care what any makeup guru tells you just don't do it it's not healthy for the skin but anyway, he bought me like five of these. I've been having very problematic skin. My skin is not like that because it's oily. My skin is like that for hormone reasons. People break out for different reasons. Some people have are hormonal. Some people are just oily. Some people, everybody has their own reasons why they break out. So my reason is definitely not um, oily. My reason is hormonal. So there's nothing I can do about that. I just, I just have to go with it. But anyway, um, and try to just do whatever I can to fix it. Um, he also got me this Too Faced White Peach Multi-Dimension Eyeshadow Palette. Beautiful also. And then he got me this um, Body Cology set. It's like a little Christmas gift set. And then I have some of these, but he found some more. He thought they looked like a little Michael Kors purse, so he bought these from Target. It's just like a little change purse. I always have my change in my coat pocket and things like that, or at the bottom, bottom of my purse. So he gets these little keychain things just for me to be able to put them. And it was a clearance item. It was $2.38. And he'll get these just so I don't have to dig, because he gets tired of every time I'm in the store. I'm like, let me dig out this change. And then he's like really yeah <laughs> also you guys I'm going to post a picture or a video clip in either or of these corners showing you guys what he got me he bought me a refrigerator for my beauty room now they do sell um, smaller refrigerators for your beauty room which is great but I just so happen to have the room in where my new beauty room is gonna be for a bigger one so he bought and it's probably like a dorm size um, like a smaller dorm size so it's a nice size and I'm going to be putting all of my beauty products inside of that fridge so I am like oh my gosh um because trust me when I tell you it's amazing I'm not going to show you the inside of the fridge until I get it stocked and I'll do that like on a room tour or something but yeah so I'll post either or corner the video or the picture of that refrigerator that he bought me so he got me these um, hydro gel under eye mask this one and also this one there's six in each one this one is under eye wrinkle I've been like really complaining about my skin and complaining about me aging and all this stuff and I guess he just felt like you know what let me just get her a bunch of products and she can just be quiet and try them out <laughs> he probably got tired of my mouth then he got me this BB bronzer glow trio by BB and then also guys um, I was gonna pick one of these up before but I'd never seen the ones that actually um, vibrate so it's a, a micro vibrating technology and it is the flawless finishing touch contour micro micro roller and massage you get two you can take this one off and put this one on or vice versa and it vibrates and it's cooling and it's beautiful and it just guys yeah I was happy about that and then I've been doing some DIY projects and doing my nails and things like that. So he picked me up these um, wax tip 
jewel setting things and you can set the jewels they're wax tip and you can just pick up the jewels and just place them wherever you got to place them and then he got me this born this way natural radiant concealer and they got him good <laughs> and then I took this out of the box but it was from Target and it is these brush sets, which I thought were so pretty. I had to take them out of the box because I was like, what is going on in there? It actually has fluid and sparkles in there. And it's just this cute little brush set. And then it comes with this bag. It just reminds me of M Little Mermaid. So pretty. So he got me that. Oh, got an itch. And then he also got me this Urban Decay Space Shimmering Powder for face and body. I wish I could take all this stuff out and like swatch everything, you guys, but I have so much stuff to go through. Um, he bought me these sponges. There's actually four in a pack. I used one today, this morning, to put my makeup on. Well, this afternoon, I should say, to put my makeup on for Christmas. And then I gave one to my daughter. So there's two left. It came in a four pack of the um, Real Techniques. And here's one of those I have one in the bathroom because I use it today and then I gave my daughter one of the toners now he got me this little lipstick holder and it's always because every time we go somewhere I'm always digging in the bottom of my purse for my lip gloss or in the sides of my purse for my lip gloss so we seen this little lipstick holder and he was like oh that's cute and that would be something she knows it's in there and she could just pull it out I just put a lipstick in here this is actually a used lipstick it's not new I put that in here just to show you guys the size that would fit in there and yeah it's just like a little lipstick holder I had one of these before and I don't even know where it's at the exact one actually actually it might have been red I don't remember and then he got me this thing because I've been complaining about my zits that have been popping up. And I'm not sure if this will work for me because, like I said, my brickles are hormonal, but it should. This is a light therapy um, acne treatment by Neutrogena. And this was clearance, actually. He bought it for $16.44. Yeah, so I was excited about that. And then hubby's like me. He will find a deal in a sale and he will grab it. He found these um, aloe nose cleansing strips, and they were only $2. So, yes, and they're aloe vera, and it's, I think it's like an Asian brand. And then he got me this Stila Stay All Day Sheer Li Liquid Lipstick. And he got me this Pons um, Dark Spot Corrector. Anytime I break out, I always get, like, dark spots, guys. So, yeah. He got me this headband. I always put headbands on my my um, head just to put my hair back when I'm doing my makeup and doing my facial treatments and my mask and stuff like that. So, he got me this cute polka dot one. And then he got me this one. I actually wore this one because I wanted to make sure that it was big head friendly which I have a big head, and I wore this one when I was doing my makeup this morning for Christmas, or this afternoon. I keep saying this morning, but I did put it on actually this morning when I um, cleaned my face after opening up all my gifts, so I guess I can say I wore it twice today. <laughs> okay, guys, he also bought me a whole bunch of fingernails. I love doing my own nails. I hate going to the shop specifically because... I like to be able to remove them when I want to. Not uh, the acrylics, you gotta go get them taken off, all that stuff. I like to be able to remove them because I don't like when I get food or different stuff in my nails where I can't, when, when it gets to the point where I can't get it out or clean it, I'm taking them off. Even if they're reusable, I can clean them, take them off, clean them, and then I can put them back on if they are worth doing that. But acrylic nails, I just don't like. So just as you see, it kinda looks like, a, um, reminds you of, Little Mermaid, but yeah, I like to do my own. So he bought me this huge bag of Kiss nails. I'll go through a couple of them with you. There's too many in here for me to show you every design. But he got these ones. They kind of look sailor. He got me these ones, French manicure tips. I mean, there's so many in here. It's hard to even. Uh, these Christmas ones I actually was supposed to wear today. Um, <laughs> he was like, oh, there's some Christmas ones in there you need to wear. Um, he had these all in one big box. I just threw them in this bag. Um, 
these ones, there's some uh, French. Um, there's these ones. I'll probably wear these in the summer. I mean, there's so many, you guys. I can't even go through them all. There's these ones here. Oh my God, there's so many. There's these ones. I don't know if you guys can even see half of them. So, I mean, it's just a ton of different designs. So, yeah, he knows how much I do my nails. So anyway, and then he said he bought this. So that way when I do take them off and they're savable, I can take one and put my um, salvageable nails in here that been used and there's two in here so he also got me this set here because I've been doing some little projects myself um, I'm building up my girly tool kit and he got me this rotary tool workshop um, kit that I've been eyeballing and I can put some of the parts and stuff um, so I don't lose them in the other one so good thinking good thinking right oh here's the other wine bag and it says last minute gift and that comes that's so cute that's so cute okay but you guys guess what i'm gonna stop this video here and do a part two because i have more stuff to show you guys so please go check out part two i'm gonna make sure that i list them as part one and part two so you know which one is which and i'm gonna show you more of what i got for christmas see you then